What's up guys? So in this video I want to talk a little bit about an awesome application called Remote Conductor for the iPad. Now this app is available for 10 bucks in the App Store and uh, basically has three main features to it. They call them Track, Launch, and Switch. And I'll touch on all three of those in just a second. The first thing we're going to need to know is that in order to use this application you need to install some software onto your Mac. Once that software is installed, use your Wi-Fi connection. You must have a Wi-Fi connection for this to work. Uh, connect your iPad to the Wi-Fi connection that your Mac uses. And uh, once those are both connected, you're good to go. Now, the first sort of big feature that this has is uh, you can use your iPad as a giant multi-touch trackpad. Now, uh, this is basically the exact same trackpad you'd find on the Magic trackpad that was released a while back and uh, essentially any trackpad that the MacBook, MacBook Pro uses. Uh, the trackpad on the iPad here supports the one finger sort of follow the mouse deal. Um, also supports two fingers scrolling and dragging. Um, also supports some three finger dragging and all that good stuff. Um, a lot of multi-touch gestures and a lot of gestures that the normal trackpads that Apple supplies uh, don't have. And all those gestures can be found down here in settings. Click on the little setting icon, click on view all gestures, it has nice little diagrams, you can scroll through, look at all the different gestures that this supports. So for those of you who love trackpads, there you go, you're welcome. Your iPad is now a big old trackpad. Second big feature of this app is the launcher feature. Now because your iPad is connected to your Mac, your iPad now sees all the applications that it runs. So down here is the dock, the dock that is on your Mac. Any application in the dock on your Mac can be opened. So say I want to open up Mozilla Firefox, open that up, boom, it's now my, my Mac rather, uh, brings me back to the trackpad and I can get browsing on Mozilla Firefox. Now, uh, along with the applications in the dock, it has pages and pages of every single application found on your Mac. So any application you want to open, you can do that right from your iPad. It also has pages for utilities, and it also has your developer tools. So anything on your Mac, application-wise, your iPad now knows what's on it. Can it open it up for you? Third big feature of this application similar to expose on the Mac it is the switcher section here and uh, basically every application that's open it's gonna be shown in the switcher and if the application has more than one window open say you got multiple finder windows open or you got multiple windows open in Safari it's gonna show so you can open up the application yourself or you can open up the specific window and uh, bring it to the front bring it to so you can see it and uh, all that good stuff. So hope you like this app I did. I don't really do that many app reviews as you guys know, but I thought this app was really cool. Integrates the iPad with the Mac. They work well together. I like it. Um, I'm gonna use it. Hope you guys too. Be sure to check out their uh, developer website and uh, app website. I'll have it down below in the crotch bar and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.